Hello world, this is Lockpicking Dev. Today I have a Malenko Magnum. It is a, I believe a seven pin slider lock. Get the damn key in there, there we go. We'll see at the end when we gut it. I have not gutted this yet. I've just seen a couple videos on it. Um, I have picked it once so far. So we'll see how that goes this time around. All right. Um, I'm going to pick it counterclockwise so that the um, the pen tumbler pins bind first. Go in the back. Another one in the back. There we go. That click felt like around around six. I'm not positive where I'm at, but that's what I'm feeling. So that's around four. Three. Try to remember not to put too much pressure on this. This does not require a lot of uh, pressure on your turning tool. I think we might have a good false set here. So, bottom pins here, sliders. Feeling anything yet on them? Let's go back on our and tumbler pins. There we go. There's a spool. There's our open. Needed our spool right there. It felt like on pin three. All right, had to cut the video because it took me a minute to figure out how to gut this, and with the help of some others online, finally figured it out. And so to help you as well, these two screws at the top, you have to remove them. Right there. Sorry, let's get this a little closer. Focus. There we go. So you gotta remove these two screws up the top, and then you have to remember, or not remember, remove these C clips right here. When you do that, it allows it to be pulled apart, and then you can gut it. So that's how that works. But we do have this already gutted. Let's show the pinning here. We can see that this is what got us caught up at the very end there. This is a very sharp barrel-like spool. It has a very sharp lip on it there. But then the only other one we have here is like a really deep, uh, almost spool-like uh, uh, pin down here. And the rest, these just sit right down into the, the plug. See, they fit right down the chamber there. And our slider pins right here. But yeah, this is a really fun lock. I've been working on sliders for a little bit. Um, I'm going to keep this around and keep picking on it because sometimes it feels like an easy open. Uh, maybe it's because it's this particular lock, but um, it is a great one to practice sliders on. So yeah, alright everyone. Thanks for watching.